Assalamualaikum. Hi everybody. Today we want to discuss about the best approximation using least square solutions. Okay, what is least square? If you are given a system of ax equals to b where you have m equations and n unknowns, we want to find a vector x in Rn that will minimize the distance of B minus Ax with respect to the Euclidean inner product on Rm. We call this vector, if it exists, a least square solution of Ax equals to B, okay, where B minus Ax. We call B minus AX the least square vector errors and B minus AX the distance of B minus AX is the least square errors. Okay, so if you see here, we have least square error vector is for the B minus AX. All right, and the distance of B minus A is called least squares vectors. Okay. Okay. If a linear system is consistent, then its exact solutions are the same as its least square solutions, in which case of the least square error is zero. Okay. Suppose that we have the column form of b minus ax okay we have this column with e1 until em so the term least square solutions result from the fact that minimizing the distance of b minus ax also has the effect minimize b minus ax square is equals to the error 1 square plus e2 square until uh, e m square. Okay, the sum of e square, the sum of this one. Eh? Alright. So, we have the projection. Okay, we have the uh, projection of uh, if we have this figure, if you see the figure, uh, this figure illust illustrated that AX cap is the orthogonal projection of B, okay, on the columns of A, that is A cap equals to projection of column A, B. Okay? And this is shown in figure B. AX cap is the projection of the column A, B. Okay. So, what is the best approximation theorem? If, we, if W is a finite dimensional subspace, of an inner product square space V and if B is a vector in V then projection WB is the best approximation to B from W is in the sense that okay in the sense that the distance of B minus project B project W B Okay. Must less than the distance of B minus W. For every vector W in W, that is different from project B. Okay, let's see this practice. Let W span in 2, 1, find the best approximation to Y cap. 3, 4 in W. Okay. What is... um? Okay, you are given 
uh, you we span to one means that okay if you draw the graph okay if you draw the graph you will get uh, two one this is two one is u is a vector u and y cap is three four okay this is y cap three four okay and uh, we have the w all right so if we um we can draw from y cap to the w so we will get that y cap okay where this is a y cap so how to find the value of y cap okay the value of y cap is the project of y cap equals to u dot v divide by u dot u times u okay okay so how do we you will get the answer to find y cap is equals to you want to find y cap is equals to okay uh, so u dot y what you can find here u dot y 2 times 3 is 6 plus 4 4 times 1 is 4 okay divide by okay uh, 2 okay 4 times 1 is 4 plus 1 uh, 4 times 1 okay okay uh, times 2 1 so when you simplify it you will get 4 2 4 2 means that means that uh, the value of y cap is 4 2 so when you want to find the approximation uh, of y minus y cap this is okay you want to find the approximation y minus y cap what is the error the error is here okay the error is here Okay, this is the error that you want to find the okay this is the error okay this square error okay you want to find y the distance of y minus y cap is equals to you can find 3 4 minus 4 2 so you will get negative 1 2 so you want to find the distance okay the distance is uh, negative 1 square plus 2 square you will get set 5 all right so this is how to find the best approximation okay using the distance okay so for this for the practice you find the closest point to y cap in the subspace span by v1 v2 so this one i let you find it okay you will find it it's because we want to find another examples okay try to do this as your exercises okay now how to find least square solutions Okay, one way to find the square solution of AX equals to B is to calculate the orthogonal projection B on the column space of W on A and solve the equation as we've done just now. And, but we also can avoid calculating the projection by rewriting 2 as b minus ax equals to b minus projection of w and then we can multiply both sides by equation of 
A transpose to obtain, okay, we multiply off this side, okay, and this side. So, what you get is A transpose times B minus AX equals to A transpose B minus project WB. Okay. So, since B minus project WB is the component of B that is orthogonal to the column space of A, it follows from theorem 4.8.7B that these vectors lies in the null space of A transpose and hence that A transpose is equal to B minus project WB equals to zero. Then this will simplify into A transpose AX equals to A transpose B. Okay, we can sim simplify that. Okay, because we know that B minus AX equals to AX. Okay. Okay, this is called... So, equation 5, 4 is called normal equation or normal system that associated with AX equals to B. So, when we view as a linear system, the individual equations are called normal equations associated with AX equals to B. Okay, let's see theorem 6.4.2. For every linear system, AX equals to B, the associated normal system, A transpose AX is equals to A transpose B. And this is consistent. And all solution of equation 5 are least square solution of AX equals to B. Moreover, if W is the column space of A, and x is any least squared solution of ax equals to b, then the orthogonal projection of b on the value is right as projection w projection w b is equals to ax. Right? Okay. Next, let's see the example of unique least square solution.